Well, I have a story um, I need to share. I need to tell it. I don't know who else to tell it to but you guys. It happened on Big Southport Trail just a few weeks ago. We had some guys that seen the Black Spirit Wolf. The Black Spirit Wolf can mean a number of different things in the native tradition. When the Black Spirit Wolf manifests itself in person or in a dream is to make you aware of your intuitions, your surroundings, the intimate nature of danger. So uh, hang in there and let me tell you what it, what happened. day a big south port a big spring meetup we had some rangers come in it was a day a lot like today about the storm you could smell it in there the rangers come knocking on our pavilion just as we was all getting ready to head out on the big big uh, 10 mile hike and uh, one of the rangers told us said uh, you guys probably ought to plan a evacuation route. Didn't say much more than that. So, couldn't hold us back. Uh, we took off on the trail. Completed the trail. There was some, some guys stayed in. Uh, when the rest of us came out. I was wanting to get some extra pictures, some extra videos, some uh, sound footage and video footage. And now this was right after the big storm. A uh, huge rain up on top of the mountains. Now the, uh, the guys had went in at the bottom. And we had to cross this little broken down bridge uh, at the bottom to get to the other side of the trail. <clears throat> well, all of us guys, we were wore out. We uh, all went back to camp. Uh, the fellows that stay, stayed in, and I'll not mention none of their names, uh, they're welcome to if they want to. They stayed in the, at the bottom of the trail. And of course, uh, they were aware that it was going to be dark when they were coming out, but it wasn't far till dark. So we got back to camp, base camp, and it wasn't too long those fellows showed back up. Well, they were a little antsy to tell their story. And uh, their story was uh, pretty incredible. They were down next to the water, all right off the trail, getting some footage. It was getting dark. Storm was happening up on the mountain. And one of them turned to a little small keyhole, keyhole sh uh, shaped little cave. It wasn't very deep um, and was interested in just taking a peek in it. One of the guys looked in and saw this huge wolf with these bright eyes and just kind of stopped for just a second. Wasn't sure what he was seeing. The other fellow came up behind him and asked if he needed a flashlight. And lo and behold, he seen the same thing. This huge wolf staring down at both. Looked right to left at both of them. 
They shined their light in the cave. The wolf disappeared. He wasn't there. Took the light away. The wolf was back. They used their intuition. They went ahead and got off the trail. They said it wasn't anything really scary. Just hair raising. So they went ahead and left the trail and came back to base camp. But we, we had went back down there later just to find out that there was a flash flood had happened. And washed the, the bridge out, covered the bridge that we had across and washed most of the trail out. And had those guys had stayed down next to the water or stayed in any longer, they may not have made it out. So I'm going to leave it up to you guys. Do you think the spirit wolf exists? I've seen a lot of stuff in the woods. You know, how do we know that we don't have this built in? That this ain't something from way back? How do we know that this, uh, when these guys were at the bottom of the trail, that these signals weren't coming from other animals to let them know that danger was coming. And it was coming fast. It was coming down the river. It was a flash flood. And our mind just manifests these things. Um, this spirit wolf to warn us of danger. Maybe it's something we don't know anymore. Uh, maybe it's something we can't grasp anymore without uh, getting closer to nature. But guys, it happened. It was there. And it put out a good warning for those fellers and got them off the trail. And the danger was real. Looks like the rain's here. Well, guys, leave any comments if you want to. It's a true story. When you're out, out there, listen. Use your intuition. Thanks, guys.